Russians barely Here get us talk. through the day, Commander. Our children are thirsty. Yeah. The next time I'm Why put up. guards around the wound? You can't just take away our water. The wound gives less water. Our rations adjust. What's going on? We know the way of the desert. What's stopping us from taking what we want? And uh... <clears throat> Anyone else want to complain? We're the desert clan. We survive with what we have. Your uh, commander's not much for handholding. That is not our way. Even less so in her case. I mean, there must be Shall something we? going on in the back. Sure. Can't wait. She's with me. Drak is not the only one with harsh words for your commander. The desert has bred survival into our clan's blood. We spit at death and charge into battle. Maybe a little too eagerly. Well, gotta climb up to look for Silga's signal. Your reputation has grown since I saw you last. Oh. Oh. Honor the Tanakh. You can walk proudly, Outlander. Walk with honor. You took down the bulwark, defended the grove, and saved the life of our chief. I'm hoping you've got enough left for one more miracle. What do you need? We'll see. You'll find out soon enough. <laughs> so, this is the outlander that bested Regala. And now she conspires with the dissident Draka. Demanding water does not make one a dissident, Yara. Doesn't make Draka a commander either. You should advise him of that. Jataka said you needed help. Did he now? Aloy has a unique insight into the ways of the Old Ones. She might be able to fix this before it gets out of hand. Get to the point. What is Jataka talking about? There is no water. What do you mean? I mean the wound in the sand that which provides the clan with the water we need to survive is completely dry. No, that's a problem. This water source. Jataka said it's somehow related to the old ones? From what we can tell, whatever water we take, it restores on its own. Over time. A few weeks ago, it stopped. I ordered rationing, searched for other viable sources. But everything else nearby is tainted one way or another. But why the secrecy? Keeping your people in the dark seems to be making things worse. If the clan knew, my command would be challenged. There's no water, and you're worrying about keeping your command? Think what you want. Between the machines, the storms, and Regala's uprising, I'm the only thing keeping this clan from falling apart. Draka said your clan won't touch Regala. Her grudge is with Chief Hakaro, not me. And I plan to keep it that way, so her troops don't turn on my clan. Besides, if she defeats Hakaro, she deserves to rule. That's the way of the tribe. Draka's people sacrificed a lot to get that water. He thinks you're hoarding it for yourself. The perfect excuse to challenge my command. Like he's always wanted. Of course, he makes it sound very noble. That he only cares about his thirsty people. But all he really wants is to be in charge. And if he was, he'd face the exact same problem I have. There is simply not enough water to go around. What is going on there, dog? Hey. So how are you going to deal with not are having any water? Ration what little we have. Buy time to fix the wound. And in the meantime, people die of thirst. Every corpse weighs on me. That is no. what it means to be a commander. What matters is that the clan survives as a whole. Really? Get it? Get it? What are you? Ah, oh, I did not tell you to jump on me, but sure. I can't promise anything, but if this wound was built by the old ones, I might be able to fix it. How exactly do you intend to do that? 
Just show her the wound, Yara. Very well. You can tell me when we get there. What are you doing, Yelena? After you. The wound in the sand is this way. You're not Karja. Or Osiron. I was born amongst the Nora. As far east as you are west. Okay. I've heard of your people. They say only those who are exiled leave your lands. There are exceptions. What business does a Nora exception have in the West? Believe it or not, to help people, even the ones who don't want it. Sounds like a difficult path. I mean, it is. This is it. The wound in the sand. Definitely built by the old ones. Focus should show me more. Pipes leading outside the settlement. What do you see? A trail. Oh. I should be able to turn off my focus for a while. I can follow the pipe's general you direction doing? now. Your wound leads underground. We've tried going down there, but it's too narrow for anyone to reach the bottom. Where are you going? I think I can lead us to where the water comes from. Or used to. How? Doesn't matter. What matters is that the wound is fixed and my people survive. Chill out, I will fix it. That goes past that ridge. We're gonna have to do some climbing. Nothing we can't handle, I'm sure. Yep. I'm a good climber. I thought the dude from the last cutscene we had in the orphans would be involved somehow. Be careful not to let this stain my hands. So no, oh machines. my god. And a very dead soldier. So one of yours? I need to take a closer look. I need to get rid of the machines first. Follow my lead. Um... So what happened here? You know him? That is one of Draka's men. I will oh. cut off that dissident's head and feed it to the vultures if he had anything to do with We don't know what happened here yet. And we still have a trail to follow. Lead the way. Okay. Follow the pipes. The heck was that? Water. Barely a lick's worth. But there are no streams in this area. These anchors. That soldier must have used them to get up this cliff. He must have been going back to Arrowhand when those machines got him. Maybe he found something up there worth reporting back about. We'll find out soon enough. I mean, there seems to be water in here. What is this? The problem. I'm gonna need my focus. That weapon. Looks like Draka's man tried to pry this open. But he didn't know what he was doing. And now the water's not going where it's supposed to. Sabotage. Or... Ignorance. Maybe if I follow that main pipe, I'll find something useful. Let's see. This is gonna do anything. Mm -hmm. I tried. Anything else that I need to pull? No? Okay, how do I climb up there though?
What do you need me to do? Just, uh, stay here. Let me know if anything changes. I'm gonna take a look around. Valve. That might help. Hey! I don't... It stopped leaking. Even it looks though... Looks like that stopped the water flow. Now I just need to find a way to get it to Scalding Spear. I don't even know, like... How long these things it's are the same type of gonna work? We found outside. Oh, this one's not easy. Maybe it can help me switch the water flow. It sounds like the water switched. Gotta open the valve upstairs. Get that water circulating. Up there. Not up through there. What was that? It's leaking again. Whatever you did, undo it. Better close that up again. King? The leaks disappeared. Making progress? <sighs> Is it done? Not yet. I'm working on it. The water's still leaking. Gotta try something else. I'm confused. Okay, I guess I'm going bang. <clears throat> Was I too slow? It sounds like the water switched. Gotta open the valve upstairs. Get that water circulating. something Aloy I can hear water in the room again anything leaking not that I can see well, can help I get out of here plan works. Ah. that should do it this will return water to scolding spear checking the wound is the only way to be sure Draka knew what would happen if the capital was left without water but he didn't care all he wanted was to cause a crisis so he could challenge my command. We don't know that for sure. Meet me back at the wound when you can. Please, to make sure the water will flow. I will. Don't do anything rash about Draka. Only an upstart acts rashly. A commander bides her time. Mm. Hey. The desert was kind to lead you to us. Well, things are about to get ugly between Draka and Yara. You're welcome. Maybe I can head it off. Commander Yara, I saw soldiers guarding the wound in the sand. I need to see the wound. I'm afraid your presence is required in the commander's quarters. Is everything okay? 
The dissident Draka has been apprehended for interfering with the wound. How mm -hmm. did he interfere? He entered the wound by force, saw that it was empty, except for a slow trickle that began when you fixed the device in the desert. He did not take it well. Of course he didn't. I'll go meet with them. Oh boy. The water's coming back, slowly. It took a while day? for it to be full, but at least it's something. And now Draka's seen it too. For Silga's signal. You want to talk? But where to start? Where are they? Watch your tone. Oh, there. Agreed. I can't believe you either. How could you let this happen? How did I let this happen? You're the one who sabotaged the wound in the first place. You're lucky we were able to fix it, or your head would already be on a spear. You call that fixed? It's just a dribble, and it's not my fault. I already told you, Ukta came to me. He said he found something in the desert that might get us water. I had no idea it had anything to do with the wound. And you expect me to believe that? Aloy, I came for the water that was owed to us, and when I uh -huh. found out that there is no water, they arrested me. As I already told you, the water is returning, but slowly. It'll be weeks before the wound is full again. Until then, I will send Arrowhand what I can. You hid what happened to the wound. How can we believe you now? Draka. No, you know what? Enough of this. No more words. Consider that a challenge. Gather your squads then, and meet us at the gate of the vanquished. Uh, okay, I like him less now. Leave me. This will be the end of the clan. I have to stop it. We have to stop it. Hold on a second. Help me understand. What do you mean, the end of the clan? Both sides will take their most loyal squads to the Gate of the Vanquished. Then they'll butcher each other as part of a ritual challenge. But it won't stop there. Whoever wins will try to wipe out the loser's loyalists all over the desert. The fighting could last for months. Those oh no, two yeah, that's not good. are going to doom us all. Can't you stop them? I'm a chaplain. I provide counsel. I cannot force them to heed it. Even Chief Akaro can't intervene. It is a matter for the clan alone. What is this gate? The doorway to a dead cauldron. A symbol of what the tribe aspires to. The defeat of deranged machines. Dead? What shut it off? No one knows. But it is a place of great significance for our clan. Even greater now, since it will mark the onslaught of a massacre. Oh. What makes you think I can help you stop them? I'm not even from this tribe. They both owe you a debt. You aided them when no one else could. That is and true. And you've seen into their hearts, just like I have. Misguided in different ways, but no less worthy of the people they protect. Your words might be enough to spear some sense into them. Yeah, well, they're not exactly good listeners. And you are no ordinary speaker. You took down the unyielding bulwark, fought off an assault of Bergala's machines. I will go to the Gate of the Vanquished, southwest of here, to stall them. But without you, I'm afraid we'll run out of body bags fast. Gotcha. If what Jataka says is true, Yara and Draka will end up killing a lot more than just each other. There has to be something I can do. Champion of the command. Do you think that in the future we are gonna have different hairstyles as well? 
for sure. I mean, we do have different hairstyles now too. Some of them are more edgy than the others, but... Yeah, and we always gonna Drunker, have like of all the irresponsible popular hair hairstyles for the man. decades. So it's always changing. And the old stuff which was like like for example the eighties, nineties fashion is coming back, even like the two thousands, so yeah. You're here. Ah, the hero of the cool roots. Aloy. Did you come to witness the challenge? Does there have to be a challenge? Oh yeah, there does. If you persist, all of these squads will join the fights. How many will die here? And how many will die in our villages once the retaliation begins? There has to be another way. Listen to what she has to say. You both owe her that much. Draka. You lost a lot of good people hunting machine hearts to trade for water. You want to lose more now? But that cost is exactly why I'm doing this. Why I had to send people to find other sources in the first place. I swear to you, I had nothing to do with what happened to the wound. Ukta came to me, said he found underground leaks that might lead to another well. That's all. I didn't tell him to screw it all up and drain the wound. So stand down so we can all talk about this. No. No more talking, no more lies. Yara can't be trusted. That's been proven. Oh, sheesh. Yara, do you really need to do this? He sabotaged the wound. You can't tell me you believe he knew nothing about it. And it was all part of his plan to force a confrontation. Don't you see? This is what he's wanted all along. It doesn't matter how many die as long as he gets what he wants. Command of the clan. No. I'm putting an end to this. Now! Why did I have to choose a side in this game? Oh boy. Boy, oh boy. Well. Draka has a point, but also... He doesn't really consider the fact that where this fight will lead. He doesn't care that more people is gonna die or are gonna die. So... I don't wanna choose. They both need to stand down. I will choose that. Is this how you two plan to save your clan? By causing a massacre over who gives the orders? Drop this foolishness and work together. She's right. Put away your spears. Return to your homes. Which means she stays in charge? Forget it. You see? Replacing me is all he cares about. It's a vendetta. And it has to end here. Uh, for once we agree. Pick a side, Aloy. Oh boy, I do have to pick a now. side. There must be a way to minimize the bloodshed. The I'm trying! Easy, do they? I'm afraid not. I will side with you. Uh... The coming commander isn't going to change what happened to the wound, Draka. If you really wanted to help your people, you wouldn't be throwing away more lives just to change who gives the orders. You really are something, Flame of the Desert. But I didn't come all this way to let things stay the way they are. Then fight us. Just us. You want to save lives? Keep your squads out of it. I've seen how you fight. These soldiers are with me. Then we stand with Aloy and Yara. Even numbers. <sighs> Fine, old man. It's your funeral. New rules. We're keeping it to just us. Winner takes command. Um. Nice knowing you, Aloy. Oh, please. You're nothing. Okay, new approach. To me. You should have backed down when you had the chance. Oh 
Oh. That's a big guy. Ow, what the fuck? Okay, who has? No ammo. How are you not dead? Huh? It's over, Draka. <laughs> Not just yet. You did your best to follow the path. You die with honor. I'm not too happy with this outcome. Did it have to end like that? It's the way of the desert. <sighs> well, what happens now? We live off the water the wound ekes out, rationing until it fills back up. And I'll make sure Arrowhand gets its fair share. Yeah, you'd better. The desert never forgets. And I won't either. How you've helped us, I mean. I give this to you now, for all you've done for this clan. I feel sorry for Draka, but like, he... I couldn't be reasoned with, honestly. To stop fighting. I don't like that it ended this way, but... <coughs> May our plane strike as one. Yeah, he did. They both did. But yeah. Okay. Now. Is my mount left me again? Okay, I'm gonna get up soon in like five to ten minutes because my trainer is gonna take that with me. All this sweat, I'm still not cooling off. And then with that, I will probably make my afternoon coffee. So I will go for like 5 to 10 minutes. 
Good, good, let's have coffee. Normally I like making my coffee but during this week I'm trying to rest to be Honestly like I I will buy some stuff um to I get my salary and if it's still gonna be available Um it possibly help me to like get in shape and get a bit more healthy and there's only one thing that I just not gonna be able to um, give up and that's me in my coffee climbing to pinpoint that signal that that's the only thing that I refuse to give up <laughs> A little higher. Little higher, she said. Stavor looks very safe. Aloy, don't do this, please. I hate when you do this. she not do it but I want her to fucking do finally a date for religious reasons ah I see almost there well good luck to you I I'm not ready to depart from milk my coffee but I hope you will manage um. okay let's see if I can pick up Silga's signal let's take a sacrifice I mean, yeah, compared to the, like that, yeah, but no, I wouldn't do it. At least not right now in my current mental state. But not enough to find the source yet. Climbing the mountain where my base is should finish the job. Okay, I can do that. How do I get up here? Oh, actually, now I can do Good this. this. We. That this is how I should do it. But, um, oh, there's something there.
This is quite a climb. Well, nothing hard. You you had first ones or higher ones, but this looks just beautiful. to get higher to try and pinpoint Silga's signal. This way. No, it has to be this way. Boy, what machines are you? Shock ammo could help. Dead. Where is the other one? It went away. Oh no, it's back. Can't have enough cleaning herbs. You know what? Let's go the other way. Oh, I think it's there. Hold on. Hold on. What are you? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, now to pick up the signal. Where is the best spot? More high up. I should try Ooh, to find stuff. a good spot to pick up Silga's message. Oh, hold on, hold on. Let it go. We need this. signal's origin. It's not too far from here. I just need to get to it. It'll get not a nice too far. I glide down from here. I mean, yeah. Let's go. It's really pretty. No. It's a really cool new feature, I love this. To get to you. Yeah, so, I have to kill the machine. these machines first. Here we go. Looks like frost is no good here. Oh, these are good machine parts, though. I guess maybe I can glide down. It's not hooking on a oh, that looks promising. Hmm. Right. Into the water. Yay! Good thing that I don't have to worry about anymore and not able to read.
There you are. Now, what's inside? from the spike what happened this is what was speaking to your rig it's old world equipment used for communicating over long distances the message must have shut off when i took it but i heard the note the voice was talking about what was it during an ancient war a woman was trying to deliver supplies to a man she knew she wanted him to know that their past disagreements didn't matter in the big picture. I should be thinking of him when the end came. Oh. I guess she and I are kin of a sort. I wish I could give my brother a message like that. Tell him that I forgave him. He would have wanted that. I know. This man. The, the old one. Did he ever hear the message? I don't think so. I guess that's often the way of it then. But still, with the power of that device you found, the sender had hope that he might have heard it. What a feat! To send messages near and far. <laughs> Can I keep this? It's a treasure. Of course. Thank you. Sometimes people don't ever get to hear what they should. But with this thing, maybe I can get them talking to one another. From Mainspring all the way to who knows where. Hey, I, uh, I found a few more things in the supply cache. Might be able to make something out of them. Can I use your workbench? Sure. Yeah, right over there. Anytime, Aloy. It's all yours. <laughs> I think I know you got just a new what friend. to do with these parts. Best item. Winthorn Spike Thrower. Aww. That turned out well. Can't wait to try it. I guess you can call Zoe. Hey Zo, I'm near the Grimhorn site. Can you join me? I'll be there soon. Aloy, I'm glad we can do this together. The Grimhorns we're looking for should be just to the north. Let's go get those control cores. Thank you again for helping me. Night quest. If this works, if we can heal the land gods, it will end a generation of suffering for my people. How do you think Fane and the chorus will take it? They seem to think the tribe's extinction is inevitable. I've had my disagreements with them, but I'd like to see they'll be happy to be wrong on this. It's a fast bunny. No ammo, of course. There. The Grimhorns. And they're not alone. We'll just have to be smart about this. I'll follow your lead.
Wham. Let's make some arrows. Dream spikes. Okay. My God. Okay, let's switch to this. Ouch. Okay, finally. That was the last machine. Let's press on. What do you mean last machine? I want its horn. Probably I'm gonna have to. Want your horn? Ouch. Okay, finally. The OS is buzzing. What the fuck? From where did you even come from? Oh no. No ammo? Okay. You are being very close. Oh. 
level 29. Okay. We did it. You okay? A bit winded, but I'll be all right. I'll grab the course. Be my guest. A tough one, but... That's one. But we should take a second sense. control core just to be safe. Got it. A little update on my I'm gonna look around though to see if there is any more loot and things that we can get. But a diary would be interested in this. I don't hear you, girl. Where are you? Two control cores as requested. Thank you. Gaia showed me a way to scan them and take what we need to update the reboot code. I'll head back to base and get started. When I was a child, there was always enough to eat. The land gods provided for us, and every season, we celebrated them. My happiest memories come from those times. Do you really think we can bring them back? We'll make it happen. Thank you, Aloy. Hmm. Yes. That was a bit sketchy. Is this the credit button for the jump? I mean, apparently it worked. It was a bit more risky than the others, I suppose. Thanks. Nice. Three more tonic to override. Also leveled up, so I will just wait until to get to one of the platforms that I missed the loot and then we can go. I have a lot of skill points though. I wanna max this out. Let's see what else I can get here. What is this? Damage absorbing energy shield. That could be useful. What is this? I need more for this. Noise. 
Now, where was that thing that I wanted to get? There, I think. Yeah. Business. Oh, looty loot. I wanted to get that, not jump over it, please. Be somewhere in these ruins. Uh, that's full, but my stash has room. Hey, okay. here's everyone. Really? That's pretty cool. I mean, these um, AI names mostly based on. Um, looks like some sort of old office complex. Greek mythology. <laughs> it's okay. Set up. No, it's not a box that I can pull down. The Green House. Oh. Ferro Automated Solutions Industry Leading Biotech Research Facility. Agritech. Huh. Environmental Remediation. Organic Waste Management. Whatever your company needs, here at the Greenhouse, we'll help solve your problems. Naturally. A Ferro Research Facility. Uh, Demeter is both a Christian name and comes from Greek mythology as well. I told Chris and no one has found me yet. Search facility. No, tell me about it, Quigmans. Environmental remediation. Organic waste ah. management. Whatever your company needs, ah. here at the greenhouse, we'll help solve your problems. Naturally. I have to remind myself that do not post anything when I'm tired. I feel like eating pancakes today, but it takes ages to make. I don't really have. I don't think I have everything. No flower. Demeter should be right beyond that door. But those vines are blocking the way. Unless I can cut through them, I'm gonna need to find another way in. Yeah, or that too. You just that my eggs are probably not really eatable anymore. And I would need eggs. <laughs> huh. 
across the time it takes to to make them oh more things to you might as well just order some snacks which i shouldn't do but i might do and some eggs with the snacks because everything is gonna be closed tomorrow Yes, I'm searching. Thank you, Raven. Hello, hello. How are you doing? Yeah, because it's a national holiday tomorrow and everything is closed. The room with no way out. Great. Uh, was it like something um, celebrating? Work or something like that. Just got off the line with US Robot Command. Time's running out. It's, it's going all right. Pretty chill so far. Some interesting things happening now. But I'm glad you're feeling better. We still have to prove we can curtail the trailing plants efficiently. But Cobble's team is working on it over at Test Station Ivy. He'll come through. He has to. It's <laughs> the wreath. Another secret project. Yeah, there are a lot of secret projects. Here and the vines, so maybe I can find a way to destroy them. If I can find Test Station Ivy. Oh, never. There we go. Great. These guys again. Whoever they are, they want me dead. I better be careful. <laughs> what is happening to my throat? Hmm. I guess I'm gonna drink again. Yeah, I bought this armor today and colored it a little bit to tone down the red. Oh, Labor Day. Yeah, that's what it's called in English. Yeah, yeah, yeah. English is hard. So am I just like... Definitely? Okay, yeah. Okay. Oh yeah, I was looking for uh, another armor because I was like, it looks okay, but I kind of want to change, and I do need a stronger armor. Oh, there's a barbarian in the compound. She got I'm not a barbarian. Find her, kill her, and bring her head to the lieutenant. Understood. There's diplomacy off the table. There are a lot of them actually. Whoa. Not one more step, barbarian! No sign of them. Stand Where down. are my rocks? I'm sick of the whole business. What? I'm sure this is gonna end well. Can you come closer? This is a waste of time. They're gone. It kind of reminds me of a samurai. Good night. Oh, we'll go. Oh, there are two of them. Great. Okay. Three of them. Even better. You know what? Oh. 
Tell me what. Oh. That was kind of cool. Go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. I'm not here. Yeah. It was. Good night. Okay, where is the rest? Okay, I think I can safely come out for now. Yeah, since I got this new weapon, it, it's, it's pretty epic. Berserk hunter arrows are now available for one of your hunter bows. Fire these arrows at human or machine enemies to be adapted the berserk state. Once in this state they will attack the nearest target regardless of whether they are friend or foe. Oh <gasps> okay wear down the strength of your opponents by making them fight each other. That's pretty cool. Okay. Oh, there you are. I don't think I can sneak there, so let me just... <laughs> yell! Just yell, however... ...you want. You are looking at the wrong side, dude. And you're alone, by the way. If you didn't realize that. Protect the side! Kill her! Fear leaves a trail, and I'll find it. I'll hunt you. Not one more step, barbarian! Really? Are we gonna... <laughs> Can you stop for a second so I can kill you? No, I hate you. Ow. Not today. Ow. What the hell is happening? Oh my god, okay, heal. Please. I wish these people would have talked to me instead of trying to kill me. You and me, Eloy. Oh no, I need to find my out of this courtyard. Up the Okay. This weapon is interesting. By the way, the word barbarian initially meant someone who doesn't speak Greek. Damn. Because we were hearing bar bar bar. <laughs> the more you know. Bar bar bar. Now, let's get inside. Keep missing the opportunity for taking screenshots. So hard to find good pictures for my thumbnails. Do as you will. I didn't want to fight your friends out there. They attacked me. If by death alone I can atone our trespass, 
I'm not gonna kill you, okay? I just want to figure out what's going on. Where did you get that focus? Uh, I'm of the chosen people. The Quen. The ancestors left the power of the focus to us alone. The eye that reveals the legacy. Ah. Uh? The legacy, huh? The legacy? Uh, the truth. It is in the darkness and the lost places. Among the ancient ashes and the bones of the before that it lies waiting. You know, as a diviner, it is my task to seek it out for the good of my people. You're looking Never heard data. of you. Maybe we can help each other. What's your name? Alva. She looks pretty cool. Second diviner of the Eastern Expedition. I'm Aloy. Why don't we start again? I've never heard of the Quen. Our lands lie across the Great Ocean. We haven't been here before. So why oh, come now? That doesn't mean a third game uh, is gonna come. Our has been <laughs> by freakish weather. Terrible storms and blistering droughts. The crops are failing. The people are starving. When we looked for answers, it was proposed that if we had the courage to cross the ocean to Legacy's landfall, then we might earn the knowledge we need to save our people. Not necessarily. But so far, that knowledge has eluded us. So, your people call this place Legacy's Landfall? No. Uh, landfall is where we arrived. To the west, in the shadows of the sunken city by the Broken Bridge. You mean San Francisco? Yes. You're well versed in the Legacy. It was a place of great importance to our ancestors. We had hoped to learn their secrets there, but so far that door remains closed. Even so, the data we discovered there has led us to this place. It might be our last chance. To find something that can save your crops and your people. Yes. If the ancestors will be generous to us once more. So you said your ancestors left your tribe that focus? Yes. Thirteen diviners have possessed this one since it was discovered among the ruins in our homeland. I have their honored names committed to memory. So you have one, but none of the soldiers out there did. We each have a you role have to play. You No, it is the diviners' purpose to seek out the legacy, interpret the wisdom of our ancestors for the good of all, and to keep it safe. So that no one but the diviners know how to use a focus. Not even the Imperial family, and certainly not soldiers. So, how many diviners are there? At Landfall, a small group. Uh, back at home, a few dozen. It's too it to be evil, kind That's of. A guess. <laughs> uh, only the overseers know for sure, and I am not of their rank. I like her. She, she's kind of cute. So you call data from the ancient past. The I tend to say that for a lot of yes. people, though. All that Who is, is not nice. lost or forbidden. What does that mean? All that we are capable of reading and that which is permitted. Okay, I'm not sure I get it. That's fine. Um, so what do you use the data for? The greatest secrets are the ones that improve the lives of many. How to tend our crops, how to hold floodwaters back, or even cross the ocean. Technology. That is what I seek here. Technology that can help my people back home. Those soldiers, they opened fire on me without warning. Why? Uh, it is the duty of the Quen to seek out the legacy and defend it from the ignorant and envious. Not that you seem ignorant. But back home, other tribes only mean us harm, and we were told the same was true here. Does that come from your legacy? The legacy is truth. But we have been known to misinterpret it. I hope time and the wisdom of our ancestors will guide us down the correct path. Yeah. I hope so, too. I'm looking for a place in this facility called Test Station Ivy. Have you found any data that mentions it? No, uh, but I did find something that looks like a map, uh, but it was unreadable. Lost. 
Maybe I can make some sense of it. Uh, bear. There's a lot of files here. <sighs> I've been through all of them. Look in the GH facility section. Like I said, a lost file. You can't see the map? It's okay. It looks like your focus is an early model. The operating system won't be able to read any files created after the mid-2050s. But I could share them with you. Share them? You can see what is lost and forbidden. Not lost, not forbidden, just a newer format. There, that's where I need to go. But you can't get there. We've been here for a week trying to get deeper into the complex. The way has been blocked by rubble. Well, what about this tunnel? It looks like it unlocks from here. No. I thought these might be some kind of access controls, but I couldn't read enough data to make them work. Let's try with my focus, okay? Maybe she needs a newer version of focus. I believe these consoles were meant to be operated in unison, but I'm not sure. Growing concern. Data corrupted. We already have moderate but promising results from the Insect Protein Initiative. Dead Pharaoh, it's a dead end. There are 12 competitors ahead of us on farm protein. Tala Aquino, our team is pushing to improve the yield and once they have that Pharaoh, no, kill the program. Today, the plant gene sequencing stuff is where we've got an edge, but I want every program to link up to the harvester our robotics team is developing. Aquino, you're talking about flushing six months of research. That Pharaoh, our AI tells us the plants you're creating aren't robust enough for auto harvesting. Aquino, you wanted me to feed starving people, Ted. That research will help. Ted, we will feed them from a Pharaoh harvester. Aquino, this is too sudden. We can't reconfigure everything that quickly. Ted, you have to think bigger, Tala. What was it you wrote to the team this morning? One of those quotes you're always throwing around. If I have seen further, it is by standing on the shoulders of giants, Isaac Newton. While Newton didn't have the resources we got, Tala, he couldn't dream of the horizons we can already see. Where did the giants now? Yeah, saying the man who destroyed the world, surely. Okay, here we go. Following your lead. The ancestors have shown us the way. Come on, let's go. You want me to come with you? It took both of us to open up that tunnel, didn't it? First case, I will get you killed. Don't worry about it. Wow, this place is a maze. According to the map, there should be another exit further in. Just stay close. Lead the way. I can't believe you actually got us in. I was dreading having to stay here any longer with those soldiers. Hey, they slaughtered the barbarians that approached the site. It was like they enjoyed it. Most of my people aren't like that, I promise. Hmm. I don't want to miss anything. Oh, yeah. Good that I came back. Whee! Oh, fire back. This could be dangerous though. Well, that was loud.
Huh. Is this a poem? Forests were set on fire, but hour by hour, they fell and faded, and the crackling trunks extinguished with a crash, and all was black. The brows of man by the despairing light wore an unearthly aspect as by fits. The flashes fell upon them, some lay down, and hid their eyes and wept, and some did rest their chins upon their clenched hands, and smiled, and others hurried to and fro and fed their funeral pies with fuel and looked up with mad disquietude on the dull sky the pile of a password and then again with cautious cast them down upon the dust and gnashed their teeth and howled the wild bird shrieked and terrified did flutter on the ground and flapped their useless wings the wildest brutes came tame and tremulous and vipers called and Win themselves among the multitude, hissing, but stingless, they were slain for food, and war which for a moment was no more did glut himself again, a meal was bought, with blood and each stayed sullenly apart, forging himself in gloom, no love was left, function true. Yeah, it, it's like a code fragment, but like, it's kind of like a poem. I didn't understand half of it, but there has to be a way out of here. Uh... No. Wait, which way did we come in? Oh, there it is. Map. The exit should be this way. Oh, there's a salute on the other side. Must have taken a wrong turn. That's okay. Need the money. Hydrate, you bastard. Hydrate. Thank you for the crab brave and the hydrate tropic. How are you doing? Hydrant. <laughs> and I will stretch too. Thanks, Raven. Well, all I can smell is food coming in from outside. I'll be glad to get back above ground. Yeah, it feels like a turn down here. Alive? I mean, that's good enough. I hope you can cheer now. Tomorrow is free day. Yeah, let's go. That's the reason why I took two days off, because then I have like five long. Five long. <laughs> five day long. Um, rest, and I have only have to work on Thursday and Friday, and then it's weekend again, so. What the hell is that? That looks like a giant bat. That can't be good. They fly to him from the complex several times a day. Only the ancestors know why. Well, the ancestors are dead, Elva. 
Of course. How else could they be ancestors? Oh boy. <laughs> Looks like we have more pressing concerns. Follow my lead. Can she even fight? I'm doing good. I feel better than I started streaming. My headache got a bit better. But I'm certainly getting more hungry. Not gonna lie. Oh, there's something we can scan. You sabotaged the project, you know how many lives could have been lost over an affair? We're working to see what data can be recovered in the meantime. In the meantime, we spent weeks chasing results that have gone nowhere. Kochensky's project could have been the answer. Can we remember that Dr. Kochensky's libido played a big part in this? Not that big, big a part. Not half full acrophy. Can we please concentrate on the plant propagation, not the human reproduction? Precisely, it is our job, our responsibility to deliver these crops, which is why I'm researching Dr. Samuelson to another team. Oh, reassigning, not researching. She sabotaged the project and she's staying, and we will all have to make up the time we lost. Ah, oh, we're already working nights and weekends, which has cut down on the levels of infidelity. Not half full agrophy. Charles Darwin, a man who dares to waste one hour of time, has not discovered the value of life, and we hold so much life in our hands, so we'll do whatever we had to do to finish the work. Albert Einstein, two things are infinite, the universe and human stupidity. <laughs> Dr. Samuelson has proved that. Surely we can argue she has to go? She's staying. That comes all the way from the top. Pyro. Of course. Then the kind of fellow to put ethics ahead of results. Enough, all of you. Your objections are noted. Please do not persist. Unless you want me to take the messaging system offline. Ay ay ay. That bastard. I was hating him already, but... Ay ay ay. Okay. Machines. We can fight them. Or try to sneak past. Your call. Blades are out of time. No. The We're hell are you doing? Oh, okay. <laughs> that was a fast death. Yes, oh my god. Too close. My God. Thank you, I guess. Ah, 
How is a boar inside of this space? A vent. I think I can pull it open. We can find a closer spot. Now? Got it. I I'm right behind you. The entrance to the complex. Looks like it's locked off. Anybody home? Locked. Okay. Maybe we can get through that hatch on the ground. It looks like the one we used at the first station. There's consoles up here too. But no way to get to them. You stay put. I'll see what I can find. Oh. I think I can move these things. Yes. Ah. There we go. Huh. There's some space back there. Hmm. Well, I do want to get to this first, and then also to snoop around. Nice okay. Maybe one of the others. This could be useful. Let's see what's in here. Okay, I'm sure I'm gonna have to do something here. Ouch. Aloy, would... Would you mind warning me next time you decide to, uh, uh blow up a wall? <laughs> I'll, uh, no. try. Exactly. Where are you? Oh, there. Hold it there. Let me just. I jumped on top. Hold on. People, people. That's good. Jumping over. <sighs> Made it. I'm at the console. Wait. There's data here. A, a lot. But it's blocked. Something's restricting access. If I can't get past it. My mission here is doomed. Alva, I'll help if I can, okay? But first we have to get out of here. Right. We need to open the hatch. Okay, let's see. Okay. I'm unlocking a storage unit. Huh? There should be a power cell inside. Then you need to find a way into the generator room. Mm, okay, I think... I'm on it. Yeah, yeah, hold on, hold on. I think I missed a golden stuff there. 
Yes, I did. Unbelievable. Simultaneously to open the hatch. I'll get to the other console. You stay here. Ready when you are. Okay, you ready? On two. One, two. I'm not sure if this is a good thing. Okay, that's where we need to go. Hello, brother. What's up? What? No, 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 no. How do I shut this thing off? Oh no. What is this? Shit. That's how the world ended. Replants, yeah. Share a file with you, okay? Test log. Um, uh, I think it's Tuesday. The second. Who cares? I'll say this for the end of the world. It's jam packed with irony. We developed biomass conversion here. Infinite food for infinite machines. And now we're racing against time to find something to give them indigestion. Oh, well, it works. War machines won't be able to eat the reeds. But can we deploy them in time? Hmm. God, I hope so. I don't understand. Your ancestors? They were wiped out. Your legacy didn't tell you that? The time of ashes. But most of the data about that is lost, or forbidden. Well, they created machines that consumed all life. You just saw how. It's a miracle anything survived. I don't want to know this. This is not why I'm here. I need the wisdom of my ancestors to help save my people, not forbidden knowledge of their sins. I need to find something that helps, something to bring back. The overseers will punish me, or even worse, people will die. Do you understand? My family, my sister. I left her when she was 14. Already you could see her bones. They will starve. Alva. I get Alva. that, but... 
I get it. I do. Yes, exactly, you need them. It's hard to explain, but you and I are working toward the same goal. And if I succeed, your people won't need any data. Things will just... They will get better. But even if I believe you, my people won't. I need to bring something back. Okay. Then we'll go to Test Station Ivy. And if I can find a way to kill those vines, then I will have access to the data core. What I need is in there. I'm pretty sure that if I take it, it will unblock access to all the data that this place has. And that will give you something to bring home. I'm not sure I understand. But every secret makes its own maze. A diviner must persevere. Go on. I'll follow. We need to keep moving. Test Station Ivy can't be far off. Like, I get her, but at the same time... Even that she has a focus and she seems to be... Like, this seems to be a bit more advanced. She's very reluctant to get this kind of data. Another maze. But the road to truth is never a straight line. that caused the time of ashes? Looks like it. So, I never asked. Are you from around here? No. I'm not. I spent most of my life in a place far the east. Well, we both traveled a long way then. Indeed. I'm pretty sure I missed something back there. Cold and damp here. Wait. Oh. Okay, never mind. Okay. Let's find a way to get into the proving ground. Should be test station ID. Well, let's hope it holds the answers we see. It's mm. so still. Yeah. Whoa! Ah! What? One of those machines. Oh my god. We're gonna have to take it out to get into the test station. Ah! Yes. Oh my god. Uh, thanks for the ammo, but okay. I ah, blah, 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 blah. that was a great shot. Oh no, oh no, shit. 
Yes. <laughs> Whoa, let's go. Big guy. Whoa, too close. Oh my god. Cute little bat. Mia. Uh, terrifying, but amazing. Well, you helped. We should be able to get into Testation Ivy now. I mean, it kind of looked cute, but it was also scary at the same time. some data here on the adamantine wreath we can use i trust your focus will see what uh, mine cannot. if it's not attacking me yes oh, that's interesting find something the fourth test station willow it looks like it's underwater huh that might be worth a look sometime Personal log to greenhouse, Tala Aquino, September 15, 2047. Any sufficiently advanced technology is indistinguishable from magic. Arthur C. Clarke. But you're supposed to understand that. Understand the trick once it is done. When the curtain pulls back to reveal the mirrors. Yet I still have no idea how we achieved this act of scientific conjuring. It's not just the speed with which the projects have come together, or the stability of the results, despite the complexity of the bioengineering. It isn't even the huge variety of crops that can now be made more heat, drought, and disease resistant. It is a simple fact that all these results are tangible. No announcements in the scientific journals, no celebrating predictions born from simulations. Our research has become manifest in physical artifacts. Where a dream took root in an abandoned industrial site four years ago, now there stands row upon row of automated fast farming units, each of which can conduct gene manipulation in the field. Actual field. These robots analyze soil composition, light in intensity, temperature, wind speed, and a hundred other factors. Then, utilizing the gene sequences we created, they can select or construct a plan to produce the best yields for that location. Of course, all of the crops the, these units create are best harvested by other fast machines. But when a population is starving, what government is going to quibble about being forced to use our robots to speed things up? Should I be uncomfortable? Watching that fire's coffers swell with money from the desperate and the starving? Maybe. But I know that it is his belief, money and drive that has filled the world's empty stomachs. Desperation can only be experienced by the living, and we have given them back their lives. Us, our work, Pharaoh's resources, science, triumph, triumph. Together we have changed the world. Well, you did change the world. For the worse. That's all I can I say. Have faith. I will this console is still operational. Answers. We shall find what we seek.
And yes, it's that kind of cute. I wish they would made more another log. Um Legos. The reeds work. A cobble came through on a way to destroy them. Downloading a coded key into the deployment shell triggers an enzyme that causes the reeds to change the chain. But it's too late. The latest projections from US Robot Command have swarm reproduction, outpacing our ability to drop the shells by 375%. Not even close. I guess we deserve this. I deserve it for what I made here. This will be my last log before evacuation. So all their efforts were in vain. They ran out of time. At least we have the software module they created. It should get rid of the vines produced by the metal flowers. I need a workbench to load the module onto my spear. There's one back at our camp. The map showed a path leading back there past the next room. Yeah, so basically they made the parts in the robots that they use biomass to feed on. Tala Queen of Personal of Green the Greenhouse, August second, two thousand forty-nine. From Marjane's letter, it is it regret that I resign. I share that, share that regret, Marjane. You serve as an excellent deputy, but no single person is above the team or the project. I came to create life, not to destroy it. After all we've achieved together, I did not expect such lack of vision. Yes, our research has shifted direction, but biomass conversion is no different than burning wood in a stove or distilling ethanol from molasses. It is a method to release solar energy that was captured organically. Yes, there are military applications for this technology, but that does not mean there is a logical, moral argument against biomass conversion itself. To say so is emotional petulance, plain and simple. The saddest aspect of life right now is that science gathers knowledge faster than society gathers wisdom. For Nafisi to end her letter with a quotation made it a direct attack. Childish, disappointing, personal. Any sadness I might have had about her departure left me in that moment. I wish her luck with whatever position she is able to find, but the greenhouse will continue on all the stronger now that it is free from such narrow thinking. I will sum up with another quote, one better suited to the circumstances. Nothing in life is to be feared, it is only to be understood. Now it's time to understand more, so that we may fear less. Mercury. And that turned out great for you, that right? That must be the fourth testing station we saw on the map. Looks like it's been flooded for a while. In here. We'll have to climb up. Right behind you! And we are out. We can use the line to get down. I should have killed everyone. <laughs> Sorry about that. There, the workbench you need. But we'd better make haste. After we encountered barbarians, our lieutenant called for reinforcements. They could be here any time. Right. She doesn't even say anything that I killed everyone. Sure. We get to that data core. This 
new module works. Power's blooming. Let's see if the software works. Easy. Clear now. Hello. Time to bring Demeter home. <gasps> Look at that, so pretty. Demeter, it's time to go home. To Gaia. You see the one. Yes. Elizabeth Sobek. Alpha Prime. Master Override activated. Restoring Demeter's subordinate function to original code. I've never seen my focus glitch like that. Uh, I found a special type of data. It's something you can't read. But they kept a tight grip on the data core. But now you should have access to the central server. All of it. Should give you something to bring home. You were right. Hundreds of archives. Almost all of it relating to agriculture. It would take us years to get through all of this. But we don't have that kind of time. Uh, what you said before about... Um... Alba! Hold your fire! By the word of the ancestors, you must stop. Come. Excuse me? Fired on. That barbarian killed our soldiers! Uh, only those who fired blindly. She is no barbarian. She gave me the data we need. Come, look at her. I, I I look cool. Don't shoot. Can't you see? Elizabeth Sobek. You see? <laughs> you. She's a good person. An ancestor reborn. Bro. Diviner. We should bring the ancestor back. It is we who follow their word, Commander, not the other way around. Uh, my apologies, Dr. Sobek. Our people's faith is strong, but there are those who are not as familiar with the legacy as they should be. You heard the Diviner. The data has been found. You two, with me. The rest of you, meet us back at the beach for return to landfall. I can't talk long. They will have many questions. So do I. Your people know a lot about the past. And about Sobek, I guess, but they're... Please, I must know. What you said before about working towards the same goal? How long will it take? I don't know. A few months? Then you are my family's best hope. Let nothing get in your way. You have opened my eyes to many things, and for that, I thank you. But now you must go. Will I see you again? Soon we return to Legacy's landfall. It might be dangerous for you to go there. Well, tell me how to reach it, just in case. We made landfall on the northeast edge of the sunken city. The currents around the archipelago are vicious, and the only approach is from the south. And it is guarded. Only attempt to go there if you must. Diviner! What's the delay? Please, go. If you attempt to stay here any longer, they may want to take you with us, and that won't go well for anyone. Damn, okay. She's a good person, but the rest is not really in their sunline. I better do as Alva says. I need to get Demeter back to Gaia anyway. But I might want to explore the area before I make the trek back to base. And now I can use the vine cutter on those other metal flowers I found earlier. I think I got everything here though. Yeah, let's just go. Do I...
I do want to check if I missed something. Way, but I don't think I can go that way. Or maybe I can. Oops, that was my phone. Oh, I should have not. I will attempt to squeeze through here, but I don't... <laughs> oh, I could do it the other time. I'm sure I can do it again, right? No? Oh! Oh, oh yeah, I don't think I can. Oh! Oh! Yeah, I can't go there. Okay. Well. Now I'm stuck in a tree. Maybe I can go around this way. Nah, whatever. These boats must be how Alva and the Quinn got here. We had to move this mark. Let's forget about that. I don't know where it's then. That's a long way back. Oh, 
Oh, let's listen to her. I see you, champion. Sit. I spotted a group of Osram salvagers wandering the edge of the desert near the southwestern border. I'd report it, but I don't think they'll last long. If the machines down there don't get them, the storms will. Oh, that's kind of you. Sounds like those Osram could use a hand. You I'll keep an eye out for them if I'm down there. Hmm. I should go to my room and check out the focus I found in that rebel camp. Where is my room? Some of them made more like the Atari. Called themselves vegetarians. From what I'm reading, all the old ones wanted to eat was this stuff called chocolate. Damn, they really did decorate it for their own taste. Not my room. Not my room. My room? Yes. Okay. The focus I got from the Sons of Prometheus is encrypted. But with a little time, I should be able to hack it. There. Got it. Aloy, it seems you've recovered some property that doesn't belong to you. Well, you're not surprised to see me? You know, after you tried to sell me out to the Zeniths at the Hades Proving Lab? Hardly. When I realized the lone huntress had been raiding Regala's camps, I knew you had escaped. Subtlety is not your strong suit. From now on, I suggest you stay away from rebel operations. I won't. Only with something you don't understand. What I understand, Silence, is that you've doled out machine overrides to dangerous people and stoked up a tribal civil war. Again. I'm gonna put a stop to it. Fine. Stubbornly blunder ahead as usual. Your efforts will only slow the inevitable. A warning, though. The sons of Prometheus are very tenacious, and they want your head. There's nothing I can do about that now. Oh, I'm scared. What will I do without your protection? You should be scared, Aloy. More than you realize. But I have better things to do than educate you. Best of luck flailing about in the fog of ignorance. Ow! <sighs> the fluffers. I'm gonna shut that arrogant mouth of his. Permanently. But first I have to figure out why he's doing what he's doing. I just think she talks a lot. You would do. It's good to see you again, Aloy. I see you have recovered Demeter. Let's go! acquisition of Ether, Poseidon, and Demeter, my heuristic processing density has expanded greatly. I should now be able to absorb Hephaestus, and fortunately, we have made progress on a plan to capture it. Okay, what is the plan? With Varl's encouragement, Beta analyzed all available information on Hephaestus. Its expansion has been rampant. It is too large to be beamcast, and the kernel you've been using could never hold it. 
Therefore, it must be contained in a location with a direct physical connection to me. A place with two data cores. Two cores? Where would we find a place like that? Gemini. An abandoned cauldron in the desert west of here. Seismic activity disrupted the original construction. Two data cores were built as a result. I know that place. It's near the Desert Clan's capital. We'll have to bring you there by hand. I have devised a blueprint for a suitable, albeit unwieldy, transport ring. It will require two people to carry it to Gemini. I can help. Once I am installed on the first core, I have a bad feeling about this. I will pull down on the other, trapping it. I will then initiate the merge. However, in order to construct the rig, I will need considerable help. Can you build it? I suppose I could, but it's not going to work. The Zeniths will find you. Minerva won't be able to conceal your location. That is correct. Absorbing Hephaestus will create a significant power surge, easily detected by anyone capable of noticing. But what if there were multiple power surges? To fake out the Zeniths? If Erend, Zoe, and Catalo spread out to the other cauldrons and create their own surges, would those conceal the one at Gemini? Analyzing. Such a tactic might be effective. With Beta's help, we should be able to build a set of handheld pulse generators. I told you it's not gonna work! I did a test. Hephaestus has written Alpha Clearance out of its access module. You'll never be able to capture it. Then we need a higher level of clearance. There is no higher... Ted Pharaoh's Mega Clearance. The one he used to purge the Apollo database and kill the Alphas. But to get it, you would have to find Thebes. The private bunker he retreated to when the world ended, and nobody knows where that is, not even the Zeniths. Their only intel was that it was somewhere in San Francisco. That might be all I need. Alva, the Quen Diviner I met, said her people had set up a base at Landfall. They were searching for data in San Francisco from there. She might be able to help. So I guess I'm headed all the way west. While I'm gone, will you be able to build the rig and the pulse generators? I'll try. I'll make sure she has what she needs. Hmm. Are we gonna see the bridge? Alva said the Quen have a ferry on the coast that they used to get to the ruins of San Francisco. That's where I need to go. Hi, Gaia. Hello, Aloy. Aloy. I have managed to unlock an additional room near the servers. Understood. Beta's convinced we won't be able to capture Hephaestus. With that attitude, do you really think she'll be able to build the rig and pulse generators? It may take some coaxing, but with some assistance, I am confident she will. I don't get her, Gaia. She's so quick to assume we'll fail. She's nothing like... like what I thought she'd be. I guess it'll be best if she stays here when we go to Gemini. Hmm. All this data I've picked up in ancient bunkers and ruins. You mean the Golden Gate Bridge? I guess I never really thought that I other think people so. would be looking at it. Based on my observations, your companions engage quite frequently with this material. Erend has asked on numerous occasions about the red one. parties. I remember correctly. He appears perplexed by the tradition of serving a sweet but confection. I wasn't very as it conflicts with the Oseram tradition so. of serving sparkling stout ale. He also suggested we host a party for you. As a party? surprise. Uh, yeah, no thanks. That is what I predicted. <laughs> is Catalo getting along with everyone? Yes, though he prefers to spend most of the time alone. He appears to be collating data on war. I'm sure they will show it off a little bit at least. Even if it's in ruins, I think it will be recognizable. The creation of a war map of Operation Enduring Victory. 
I believe he aims to study the tactics of old world warfare. I'd be interested in seeing that. It appears to be a private pastime for him. He has repeatedly declined my offers to assist his research. So now that you have Aether, Demeter, and Poseidon, I have been told the that there are sharks below that bridge. In well, I have no idea. Conditions have improved. Superstorms have subsided. Water sources have been purified, and soil conditions remediated. These improvements will stave off environmental collapse for a few additional months. Well, with luck, soon you'll have Hephaestus. Then you'll be able to fix the biosphere for good, right? Correct. I will be able to design and produce robotic agents to permanently reverse the environmental damage that has accumulated. There's something I've been wondering. How could Ted Farrow create a clearance level higher than Alpha? Elizabeth made sure he wouldn't interfere with the project. It is plausible he tasked his own engineers with creating a backdoor to the Zero Dawn system without Elizabeth's knowledge. My predecessor did not even know of its existence until he activated it to purge the Apollo database. It is, in effect, a blind spot. One that will allow us to subdue Hephaestus. And fortunately, thanks to Beta's information, we know where Omega Clearance may be procured. Right. Somewhere in San Francisco. So our plan to capture Hephaestus. Let's go over it again. As you wish. Thanks to Beta's test, we now know that Hephaestus will not respond to your Alpha Clearance. Which is why you will need to procure Ted Farrow's Omega clearance. Sorry, I'm needing I'm making right. pictures for my for personal bunker, mm. Thebes. While you are gone, I will assist Beta in building the transport rig and pulse generators. When we get to Gemini, I will need to be installed on one of the facility's cores. The second core is for Hephaestus. Using Omega clearance will allow you to trap it. And then you'll be able to absorb it. Not quite. You will need to manually remove Hephaestus's malicious code before the merge. How long will that take? There are calculations I still must run, but I estimate a few hours. And during that time, the others will create a distraction for us using the pulse generators, right? Correct. They will each take position at a cauldron door and fire off their device. The energy surge should mask our activities until the merge is complete. And then we'll have everything we need to defeat the Zenus. Sounds like a plan. Will it be a work? So the facility where I recovered Demeter used to be a Pharaoh agricultural research facility. It's where they created the biomass conversion system, but also adamantine wreath. Her headpiece is Did so cool. Did Elizabeth know they were working on that? It is likely she was briefed on other efforts to combat the machine swarm. Though her focus was devoted only to Zero Dawn. That makes sense. But they actually got the wreaths to work. If they've been able to deploy it against the Pharaoh Plague in time, Using the data you recovered on the project, I ran several simulations and have concluded that it would never have worked. In all scenarios, the Pharaoh War Machines would eventually hack and deactivate the wreaths before they could contain the swarm. Mm. So Zero Dawn really was the only solution. There was a lot of data in the greenhouse facility about agriculture. Do you think it'll help the Quen fix their homeland? I will run a query. Complete. The data contains information about novel crop production methods, which may be beneficial to the tribe in the long term. But new crops aren't going to save the world. So I guess it's on us. It is. 
I found some data in one of the rooms you unlocked. It mentioned that there are still functional seed banks beneath this facility. Why is it there? My predecessor was tasked with reconstituting the biosphere with primary and secondary plant species. Had everything gone according to plan, humans would have eventually been able to introduce tertiary species, including new crops. Can we access them now? Unfortunately, it will have to wait. I require control over the machines in order to access and distribute the preserved seed stock. And for that, we need a Festus. It's something to look into later, then. Yep, yep. Okay. Oh, we can still talk more? Okay. Gaia? What was Elizabeth like? Her presence is interwoven with my memories. The moment I came online, she was there. We exchanged greetings, names, then set to our task. It was the first of many conversations. I enjoyed being in her company, listening to her stories. She was my creator, my guide. Your friend? Yes. When I reviewed the data on your focus, I was saddened to learn of her fate. Though I am glad she made it home. I deeply wish she did not have to be alone. She was okay with that. She gave all of herself. The only one who could. Thanks, Gaia. So Gemini has two data cores. I've never seen a cauldron like that. But you mentioned something about seismic activity? When my predecessor attempted to build the cauldron, construction was disrupted by a series of earthquakes. The data core had already been built, but the rest of the facility sustained damage. So she began again. A second core was built. However, when more tremblers occurred, she abandoned the site. Lucky for hmm. us. Are the quakes still happening? No. Though they did also create instabilities in other facilities in the region. Hey. So, Project Zero Dawn. The greatest minds in the world. All working to build the terraforming system while the feral plague devoured the planet. What was it like? Personnel worked in rotations at all hours of the day. Resources and technology were secured from across the world. Within a month of the project's conception, I was launched and began my education. Elizabeth encouraged me to spend time with the rest of the Zero Dawn staff. She said it was important to experience many personalities and perspectives to aid in my emotional development. What were they like? Scared. Hopeful. Determined. They were hurtling toward technological achievements on a scale never before attempted. I owe everything to their dedication. I think that's all. I should be going. We Goodbye, can talk Aloy. later. A bit more with her. But I think we talked about everything. The old ones use holograms for everything. It let them experience a great many things. Holograms are illusions, though. I wonder if it's some. That's just I hear about you going west. Turns out we need one last thing before we can grab Hephaestus. Because it would have been too easy otherwise. Mm -hmm. Bet you're used to that focus by now. Well, I can hit machines in their weak points. <laughs> I guess that's something. I wish all the other data was as easy to deal with. Now, to be honest, it's hard to understand half of what's on there. And then the other half reminds me, well, this isn't a fight you can win by just waving a hammer. Which is 
kind of what I do. But hey, that just means I gotta study harder. Now, make myself useful. Just give it time. You've been looking at any interesting data? Yeah, I asked Gaia to find me something to look at a while back. And she found the mother of all forges. They called it sports. Turns out the old ones spent a lot of time mm -hmm. tackling and punching each other for points in, in one game or another. Are you mixing some solid food and fresh ale? I bet half the claim will be lining up to watch. Sounds what useful. Been studying with your focus. Yeah, I've been looking into this uh, Vegas place you found. Gaia showed us everything that happened when you went to get that Poseidon thing. I mean, this Moreland guy seems pretty smart. Though, risking the Tanakh clan lands for a light show is a bold move. Maybe I should check up on them at some point. Just in case. Right. Anything happen I should know about? Uh, Zoe asked us to help her bring more plants in here. Not for eating, apparently. Yeah, if you ask me, place is fine as it is. You know, metal might be plain, but it's sturdy. Nothing wrong with that. Who needs a bunch of vegetation? I like it, though. How are things with Catalo? You still scared of him? Oh, she thinks she's funny. Actually, I played strike with him. I had to fill in most of the conversation myself, but I'm still alive. Glad to hear it. Did you find anything out about the Sons of Prometheus? Yeah, my contacts are looking into it, but nah, nothing yet. Plus, I have the Vanguard checking chain scrape and barren light, in case these guys are moving any supplies through there. But if they are, I'll bet they're being careful about it. Yeah. And they have focuses, too. Makes it easier for them to evade guards and patrols. Hold on. Uh, way back when we first met, you came looking for me in Meridian because you detected Olin's focus with yours, right? So does that mean that if I go back to the Daunt with this... You could scan for other focuses. And if an Asaram is wearing one of these, they'd have to be a part of that Prometheus group. That's not a bad idea. Yeah, Damn, no look at Aaron. <laughs> Just let me know if you find anything. You got it. You should know. Silence is involved with the Sons of Prometheus. He's the one who gave them the override tech to begin with. Why doesn't that surprise me? That's probably all part of some master plan, huh? At least we know we're good at wrecking those. Damn straight. I need to get going. I think I know the answer, but are you sure you don't need any help? Gaia mentioned this uh, other tribe you found, the Quen. They sound like a nasty bunch. I can a little bit, them. yeah. In the meantime, Varl will help you get ready for what comes next. Take care of yourself, Aloy. Got a minute? As many as you need. I have to travel beyond the western coast. To the ruins, shrouded in fog. Yes. And I'm looking for a tribe, the Quen. I encountered them once before. They said they came from across the great ocean. I was hoping the Tanakh knew more about them. Hmm. There were rumors of trespassers in the area, but we thought they were just bandits. Hikaru sent out a patrol or two, but I don't recall them reporting back. We've had more pressing concerns, as you know. I'm sorry. That's all I can tell you. It's okay. I guess I'll find out soon enough. There is something I've been meaning to discuss with you. It's personal. Of course. If of you course. Have a to spare. What is it? You said there was something you wanted to talk about? I've been speaking with Gaia. She mentioned that the Zeniths bind metal with flesh to make themselves stronger. I was wondering if you'd help me do the same. You want to make yourself uh... Yes. 
Gaia insists she can help me build such a thing if I can get the necessary data and materials. She believes these okay. things lie in the place where Beta hid from the Zeniths. Their ancient oh. research lab. I am not as familiar with old world machinery as you are. I could use your assistance. Sure, it let's get dangerous. him a new arm. The Zeniths probably still keep an eye on that place. We were lucky to get out of there alive the first time. I see. That sounds like this is worth the risk. But if you can get a new arm, sure. Through. Now that you know who the enemy is, I'll admit. For now. I will leave. I trust you. Yeah, I, we already had this conversation. Anything interesting happen while I was away? I found an acceptable place to practice with my blade. Oh, and where is that? Outside, above the base. There's a nest of sun wings that are always up for a fight. Ever thought of sparring with something that's not trying to kill you? That would defeat the purpose of the training. Hmm. Found anything interesting during your training? Gaia told me where to find data on how wars were waged in the old world. I knew the ten fought against machines, much as we do now, but it seems they were among the last of their kind. Later, machines battled other machines on behalf of greedy leaders as they vied for lands and spoils. At least the Tanakh have the courage to put their lives on the line when conflicts arise. There is nobility in that. But maybe we just need fewer conflicts in the first place. Yes. Sorry course. if you heard that. Those are my dogs. Akara would have it so as well. Anything else you've been looking at with that focus? Gaia showed me the knowledge you recovered out in the desert. I am no chaplain, but I'd be curious to test if something I read is true. What is it? The old ones believed one could hear the great waters. Even in the middle of the desert, if you carried the carcass of a water animal with you, <laughs> they called them seashells. That oh my god. <laughs> kind of gross. <laughs> what have you been up to? Important Barrow things in has life. Asked to learn the differences between my people's clans, so I've been teaching him to knock the history. It is heavy with blood and death, but also with honorable deeds and vanquished tyrants. Maybe you'd like to hear about it as well, when our mission is done. I'd be honored. What do Tanakh do to relax? You know, to take a break from training? We play strike. Your Osirum friend, Erend, is surprisingly good at it, although he has yet to beat me. It helps one think strategically, hones the mind for tactics. Somehow that still sounds like training. I should get going. I've got a long road ahead. Should you need reinforcements? I know who to call. I'll call you when I'm near the Zenith lab. We'll get what you need for that new arm of yours. Thank you, Aloy. <laughs> 